Welcome to the next stadium tour. Today we will go to Etihad Stadium in Manchester, to the home of Manchester City. So let's go with some stuff about the Etihad Stadium. It's located in Manchester, England. The club was founded in 1880 as St. Mark's West Girton. It became a rugby association football club in 1887 and finally got the actual name Manchester City in 1894. The stadium was built for the 2002 Common Health Games. When the game finishes, the stadium became a football stadium. Before Etihad Stadium was built, Manchester City played at Main Road Stadium for 80 years. In the early decades of 20th century, the citizens played at their home matches at Hyde Road, but after the ground got severely damaged in a fire, they moved to a bigger ground. Main Road opened on the 25th of August 1923 with a match between Manchester City and Sheffield United. The result was 2-1 in favor of the locals. The stadium could hold 85,000 spectators at that time, which made it the largest stadium in England after Wembley Stadium. The record of attendance was achieved in 1934 when 84,569 fans watched an FA Cup match between City and Stoke. As I told in the last stadium tour, the citizens and the Red Devils shared this stadium after the Second World War. The plans for further redevelopment were made but abandoned after the club relegate in 1996. The final capacity of Main Road was 35,156. The last match at this stadium was played on 11th May 2003. The match ended nail one defeat of Manchester City against Southampton. The stadium got final demolished in the late 2003. The last season the Sky Blues played at Main Road was in 2002-2003. Also, they played again in the Premier League and qualified to European competition after 25 years. The club moved into Etihad Stadium at the start of the 2003-2004 season. The first match was played in the Etihad Stadium was a friendly match between the citizens and Barcelona with a victory of the local team 2-1. The first official match was four days later for an international game of UEFA against the New Saints football club from Wales. The first match of Premier League was against Portsmouth Football Club. In 2008, Etihad hosted the final of UEFA European League between Zenit of San Petersburgo and Rangers from Scotland. The Russian team took the trophy to their country. The stadium initially called City of Manchester Stadium, but was renamed Etihad Stadium in 2011 following a 10 years sponsorship deal with Etihad Airways. In the summer of 2014, works start on expanding the south stand with an additional tier, which boasts capacity with 6,000 seats, and the club announces planned to add three rows of seating pitch side, getting the actual size about 55 seats for the season 2015-2016. They want to add a third tier to the north stand, which will raise the capacity to more than 61,000 seats. First June 2004 hosted a match of England national team. That year, but in October, they hosted a rugby match between England and Australia. And in 2005 hosted a game of a woman national team against Finland. The English team won 3-2. The first concert hosted by Etihad Stadium was in 2004 with Red Hot Chili Peppers. After that, other singers as U2, Bon Jovi, Rod Stewart, Coldplay, Mariah Carey, Robbie Williams, One Direction, Ed Sheeran, Beyoncé and Taylor Swift sung in the Etihad ground. Thank you. 
espejo, pero no es un espejo y estoy acá súper erizada. Siento que me entra al mal está o sea, como si fuera un lado. Aquí es prensa. Aquí llegamos. Esto fue el tour en el estadio de Manchester City, en el Ham Stadium. 